There is no denying it. COVID-19 numbers are on the rise. A local pastor even tweeted from his hospital bed, quote, out of the ICU and surrounded by beautiful servants. We've been seeing these surges in both Dallas as well as in Tarrant County. Dr. James Cottrell is an internal medicine physician at UT Southwestern. He says the Delta variant, which first surfaced in India, is here in North Texas. Who are these patients who are getting sick and being hospitalized from COVID-19? A common thread is that the majority of them are unvaccinated. According to the latest projections across the Dallas-Fort Worth area, there are more than 800 hospitalizations right now. But in two weeks, that number is expected to double. That same projection suggests the epidemic is growing at 98%, where there are 95% more infections. A question many are asking now. What are the symptoms for Delta? The other strains typically started off with head congestion, sore throat, and quickly got short of breath. The same can happen with a Delta. Dr. David Winter is an internal medicine doctor at Baylor Scott and White Health. More things like a common cold, so maybe harder to distinguish. With the other variants, the other strains, you could lose your taste or smell. That's not happening with the Delta uh, variant. Winter says when a person is getting swabbed for COVID-19, the swab is only testing for the coronavirus. And from studies, he says all of the new cases are the Delta virus. There are multiple strains of the coronavirus. Bottom line, get vaccinated. I tell them you should be nervous about not getting the vaccine. In communities where the vaccine rate is low, we're going to see a big surge of this. In Dallas, I'm Molly Basu.